is really up against it here. He's going to have to go to a final set tiebreak. So it's all very valuable time for Nadal in his preparation for the championships, where he's twice been a finalist, losing to Federer twice. Now, this bottle thing that he's got going on, John, in, in your day? Well, I, I just was thinking that, that I mean, Mac and Ron Connors, they would have gone around there and just booted those straight into touch, wouldn't they? Time. <laughs> I mean, psychologically, they, would, they probably would have waited to about this time, too, where it's just before the end of the match, where it's a bit tight, and they would have just booted it and just said, <laughs> superstition, take that. Happy Friday the 13th, by the <laughs> way. Challenge. So, tiebreak, first to seven. Could be two points clear. And the winner of this tiebreak wins the match and has a place in the semi final of the Artois Championships this year. Five times in 2007, last year, Karlovic didn't lose his serve but lost the match. I wonder if it's going to be another of those occasions for him today. We'll see. Nil nil. 1 0. Karlovic. The first tie break was won by Karlovic on one error, one double fault from his opponent, Nadal. Moments of inspiration from Nadal brought him the second one, a couple of good returns. And now here we are.
It is amazing the amount of risk that Dow takes on that forehand when he gets so far out of position on the court clay. You know, it's not as risky because it's a slower surface. He can get back into position, but in grass, it's a lot risky, much more of a risky proposition. But he gambles on it because he knows the forehand is so good and so accurate that he can get his opponent in bad positions. To all. The extraordinary total of 35 aces from Ivo Karlovic in this match. I mean, to ace Nadal 35 times normally takes an entire season. Superb serving, high percentage of serves to first serves in, 84% of first serves in in this set. Volley there missed by Karlovic. Especially when you're a right-hander on the left court and you run round a left a right-hander, should I return? And you, and you gamble on a left-hander serve because the ball is swerving away from you and he took the gamble and got right in the tram lines there to belt that forehand. That's Mrs. Karlovic there. Watching on, the mini break of serve recovered in this tie break by her husband with that big reverse forehand. Very fine match player, Karlovic. You don't get to 22 in the world rankings without knowing what you're doing. Even Stevens here. to try and get in as soon as he could in this rally but he went the wrong way with the cross court opened up the angle passing shot played under pressure if he had missed that he would have been in real trouble because Karlovic will serve the next two points Swing on that forehand. Really short backswing. Just used the pace, fed off the pace of the Karlovic serve.
Federer. It's as much the willpower as the topspin with Nadal. He's a force of nature at the other end of the court. And after two hours and 23 minutes of pretty intense one-on-one -on -one competition here against Ivo Karlovic, he has two match points. This one on his serve. Congratulations, what a match. Oh, thank you very much, yes. Amazing match, you know, against Karlovic. Especially, well, in every surface, not especially in fast surfaces, like, like grass always is a well, very, very tough match. Today, I, well, I think I played very well, especially the second and the third set. Well, the forehand feeling the, the, the ball much better than the day before, and especially very happy for being my first semi-finals here in Queens. And does he have the best serve in the world? Maybe. <laughs> In the semi-finals, you play Andy Roddick. It doesn't get any easier. The defending champion here. Always difficult. No, another big, big server. So just go on court, try my best, and wait. <laughs> is this the best you felt on grass going into Wimbledon? Well, it's my best result before Wimbledon. No, so it's my first semi-finals in one tournament previous uh, the Wimbledon. So right, right now, this tournament is very, very important, and for me, it's a pleasure to be here. Thank you very much, all the people, for supporting me every day. No? And I think the people here would like to uh, thank you again for what a, was a wonderful performance. <laughs> thank you very much, everybody. Thank you.